The Pentagon says the USS Kearney, a Navy destroyer in the international waters of the Red Sea, was in the line of fire when Iranian-backed Houthi militants launched a number of missiles and drones from territory they control in Yemen over a six-hour period. U.S. Central Command says as the Kearney came to the aid of the cargo ships after they were hit by the ballistic missiles, they were forced to shoot down three drones, also launched by the Houthis. We cannot assess at this time whether the Kearney was a target, uh, but the Kearney took prudent action in taking down those three UAVs. These are surveillance drones, basic just cameras looking to be able to identify certain ships to be able to understand what the U.S. is doing. The Pentagon blaming Iran, releasing a statement saying we have every reason to believe that these attacks, while launched by the Houthis in Yemen, are fully enabled by Iran. Iran denying involvement. We are taking this time to consult with allies and partners because we believe this is not just an issue for the United States. This is the latest attack by the group in the Red Sea. Last month, the Houthis releasing a video showing armed members using a helicopter to hijack a cargo ship. And in late October, the Kearney intercepted four missiles and 15 drones headed from the Houthi-controlled territories toward targets in Israel. The Houthis claim their goal is to target Israeli ships. Israel's military claims that at least two of the merchant ships had no connection to Israel. In a statement, the Houthis say they targeted two of the commercial ships in part because they rejected warning messages from Houthi forces. Ike Jachi, ABC News, Washington.